I'm trying to rebuild the community in which one day I will die. My hood is your hood, and your hood is mine. Jumping over barricades, ducking under yellow police tape, tiptoeing past white chalk, fanning gun smoke out my face. My vision is pigeon-toed no more. We need help down here, supporting Cali streets, like we all in New York, trying to rebuild the community in which one day I will die. My hood is your hood, and your hood is mine. L.A. got twin towers too, packed with poets like me and you. That's me you see on the sidelines, asking questions, walking infants to safety, passing out first aid on a bullhorn, going horse, losing my voice, trying to rebuild the community in which one day I will die. My hood is your hood, and, and your, your hood, hood is mine. mine. Horseback riding the metro, using the freeway as my lasso, hog tied in harmony, from Beverly Hills to Baldwin Park, Encino to East LA, it don't matter where you stay, we gonna get there someday. Street Poets is a poetry-based violence intervention and community building organization. We use poetry and the creative process and music to help transform the lives of young people and in the process transform the community and the culture in which those young people live. When a young person starts to explore their wounds and give voice to them, there needs to be uh, a community around them that sees them and can help support them and support that authentic self as it works through the layers that may be obscuring it. For those wild at heart and kept in cages, let yourself breathe in knowledge that your soul can feed on. Spot a new beginning in fertile soil and rejoice that new beginnings are possible. The core of our programming has always been in juvenile detention facilities for boys. But we have branched out over the years in order to reach different populations, primarily to reach female populations of high-risk young people. I consider Street Poets my family. No matter what happens in my week, I know that every Tuesday there's a workshop called Seeking Peace. I don't know, I just felt alone a lot in the world. And when I started going to Street Poets, like, I don't know, somehow life had more meaning. You women had three or four kids to contribute to the world. Born of a mother with a contagious laugh, but an even more contagious rage. She would hit you in your face and kiss you the next day. Now I don't know what that was like, but sometimes you would tell me. Horror stories of a whacked out lady who beat Uncle Pops with a shoe so he was bleeding from his forehead. And when she was gone, working her ass off to pay the mortgage, we were gangbanging. Drive-bys, getaway cars, and the nightlife. It's okay to feel strong. It's not okay to hurt people. It's good to pray. Our wishes are heard by a higher power that you choose. Taken care of, so you can be kids. We the elders want to give the world a more hospitable place to live. That's what I pray. That's what I dream of today. <laughs>